Hello, it's me, Jackalopium. Welcome along. We are back in Night City, in particular the North Oak part of Night City. It is night in Night City. Look at all of these expensive style cars. Um, so yeah, we know we're in the posh part of town. North Oak is like the kind of upper class part of town. Um, but you can tell just by the quality of the vehicles. We're going to meet Johnny Boy. And we're going to go and talk to... After we talk to Johnny, we're going to... There he is, look. We're also going to talk to... Kerry Euro Dollar. So why are we here exactly? Heard Kerry got himself a buck of mansion here. Done well. Where'd you hear anything about Kerry? Beautiful that all looks. about town. Scream sheets are full of shit about him. Oh right, you weren't around. Mm-hmm. Your boy's night out. So what? Want to pay him a visit? Yep. Seems as good a time as any. Um. So I gotta hit Carrie's digs, look around, critique the drapes. Know what they're writing about him? He's depressed, attempted suicide. What really worried he wants to hurt himself? Who knows? Either way, could give him some pointers. You yeah. want to go in person? Gotta hand you the reins again. Yes. Behaved myself last time, didn't I? I think I warrant another furlough for good behavior. Didn't he, like, party and make us bath? He, like, partied with strippers. Okay. But I want to know what you plan to do. Oops. Nothing stupid, I promise. Just want to see how he's doing. How you plan to tell him it's you? Could be dealing with some real personal shit right now. Might not be the best time to mess with his head. V-Care was always dealing with personal shit. That's why, in spite of everything else, we got along. Don't worry. I'll play it by ear, sensitively. First things first. We gotta get into that house. Okay. Just let me know when you want to take the wheel. This is uh, pretty interesting. The thing is, I have been to Kerry Euro Tunnel's place uh, before, while I was just wandering around Night City. So, there are now no more kind of security measures. Let's uh, just take uh, take the arch. Get there in some kind of style. <laughs> I mean, this is my preferred choice of mode of transport for Night City, is pootling around on my motorbike. And I love the Arch Nazare, however you want to pronounce it. Nazare, maybe? It's uh, really nice. So yeah, I've already taken care of the security. At at Kerry Euro Tunnels Mansion. Do we want to? Ah, oh, let's just leave it in front. Doink. Actually, we don't want to shoot up the joint, really. Uh, I mean, we could go for a little jaunt around. It is quite a nice place that he's got. It's quite a nice mansion. Look at it. Very kind of uh, Frank Lloyd Wright. There's quite a lot of opulence. Uh, and yeah, there would be like security robots walking around. Um, but I have killed them all. I killed them all previously. I did find Kerry Eurodyne's place. Like I say, while I was just wandering around the joint. Hope it was expensive at least. Something's got to justify this level of tacky. Uh, I am going to have a quick look around for lore. Wicked bad collection. Well, now I am impressed. 
played a few of these myself back in our samurai days. Where's that wall? There it is. Uh, that's a review of one of Carrie's oh, songs. Fuck. Cookie cutter crap straight from a catalog. Doubt Carrie picked this. Always ate out. Always. Always. And so, yeah, we will have a quick look around inside his digs. There's his hookah. We have seen these walls previously. Vintage guitar. Uh, next one. Vintage Balakaila. Acts like that run us many eddies. Forget it. We couldn't afford it. That's Carrie's face. Um, yep, it's not letting me search that. Okay, he's got a nice drum kit. He's showering, it Looks seems. Like he's showering. Alone, too. Good thing, believe me. Okay, leave the rest to me. I'll get him out of there. Uh, let's just have a quick look around upstairs. Grab Kerry's gat. Just make sure we get the law. Who is Lizzie Wizzy? Um, yeah, we know Lizzie Wizzy. We know her quite well. Um, yeah. Is that a roll of uh, bills? Yeah, we can't pick it up. Nice kind of open plan mansion. Wonder why it wouldn't let me uh, move through the solo career of Kerry Euro Tunnel. And that might be the last piece of lore. There you go, after Johnny Vanished. Yeah, I mean, Kerry Euro Tunnel must be like in his 70s. <laughs> He's another one of these uh, kind of leftovers from the time previously. So, obviously, we met Rogue. Uh, and then Kerry Euro Tunnel is one of those as well. I mean, would anyone really want an album of some guy who's like in his... You know, he's approaching his 80s. <laughs> Not being, you know, ageist or anything. It's just... Look at Kerry's sports car there. We do actually have one of those. It's a Guinevere. I think I drove one a little while ago. Drop one of Misty's special pills. Let's go. Okay, we're going to let Johnny... Okay take control <sighs> feels so much better now let's see what you're up for show and what you're actually strummable um we could play chipping in or never fade away or archangel let's go and never fade away
Oh God! Keep playing. All right. Ah, look at him picking. That's awesome. Gary. No. No. His posture is terrible. Look at the way his, uh, his model is. That's awful. I told you to stop being a pussy. Did you? Huh? Johnny fucking Silverhand. Fuck. I mean, how? Surprise. Motherfucker. Oh dear. Okay, weren't expecting me. I get it. Oh fucking contraire. Been waiting 50 years to do that. So you changed a bit. Nice rack. Thanks. Sporting a new style. Nah, kinda. What about you? Shit. Johnny. Oh man, you need a drink. All right, come on. Tell me, why do you look like a small-time kleptopunk from the afterlife? This is V. You'd like her? The fuck, Johnny. Doesn't explain a thing. Nice place. Ain't seen much of it yet. Moved in after the fourth album came out. All sold well, apparently. Fuck. You, Johnny. Don't even start. Who'd you sign with? Shit. With Arasaka. Mornings, I record at their studio. Then evenings, Yori pops over for a little neighborly cookout. Hmm. And who'd you really sign with? MSM Records. Another pillar of society. Come on. Sit down with me. Tell me where you've been all this time. Steal yourself for a long story. I just really want it to be tragic. I'm sad as all fuck over all those years. Cause if I hear you spent them with the nomads, open road, winning your hair. He looks like he's made out of noodles. And now you just pop by to shit all over my life? Well, I'ma lose my damn mind. Listen. Judge for yourself. Oh, fuck. Remember? The one damn time Henry showed up sober and clean as a whistle. Uh-huh. And played absolute tripe. At least Danny was happy. Uh, let's ask him about you being depressed. that depression. Is it true? Nope. Promo strategy. Suicide attempts too. Think putting a bullet through your skull will help your sales? Didn't work for you. Nobody remembers Samurai. Now you're just butt hurt because I managed fine without you. Fuck me. Got no answer to that. <laughs> Never did get what Denny saw in that guy. I mean, smart imp, that one. Maybe too smart for the company she kept. Nah, Denny always went for losers, incapable of dressing themselves. Oh, Hank was perfect. Half a brain and high all the time. She got to rescue him over and over again. Why'd she never try and fix me? Would have had to get in line, that's why. Still in touch with the gang? Just Nance. Changed her name to Bess Isis. Oh! Works for N54 News. Didn't see that coming. Could track down Denny and Henry if you want. Maybe get together. You know, jam or something. Best Isis. Damn, Nance really went for it. Though all I hear is part-time stripper. The thing for ancient Egypt. Shame you died. Sure, she would have welcomed your input. How is she in general, besides having nothing to do with music? 
Could ask her yourself. Henry probably killed his own liver. That nah, would have hurt if he was gone. Got mutual friends. A few calls and I should be able to track him down. Then he might still be in the base. Actually had talent. There's a Danny from the room. Yeah, release something not too long ago. Moved to North Oak, too. You just said you weren't in touch. Didn't hear from her. I think she might be avoiding me. You ever leave this house? Nope. You want to bring Samurai back? Nah, no. Could do one gig. Play some dive where nobody plays us. I mean, got my reputation to think about. All right, let's do it. Let's bring Walk. Samurai back. We'll be uh, okay. we'll be dusty old men. I'll send you Nancy's number in a sec. And I'll go women. after Henry and Denny. I'm not there. Figure it out with me. Sure. Uh, you two get along. Sure. Kid loves me. Yeah, I bet. Yeah, I do have Bess Isis slash Nancy's number on speed dial and my phone, so I can contact Johnny, her. Johnny, you okay? Johnny boy! No. Ah, so you must be V. Johnny mentioned something like this might happen. You two have fun at least? <laughs> I mean, we are moving up in the world. We are rubbing shoulders with Just sit tight for a bit. the yeah. Hoi Polloi, Don't worry about a thing. the Arasakas, How is this concert thing? the Silver Hands, it's sharper as the pills wear off. and so? the Eurodynes of the world. Samurai live? Probably won't get another chance. What if this ends up like the rogue thing? One big letdown. No, this is different. Carrie needs this concert. Okay, call in Nancy. Fuck yeah, nice. Nancy uh, Hartley. Oops, hold on. Let's hear what he has to say. Emerging from his silky samurai chrysalis. There he is. There, look. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. That's tasteless. Anyway, let's. Uh, Let's phone Nancy. Nancy? I mean, Bess? Bess Isis? No, this is her underpaid, underappreciated assistant. Stephen, N54 News. How oh, can I help? I'll give him that. Talk one. to Bess. She's not here. Calling from Carrie Uridine's residence. Cool. But Bess still isn't here. She was supposed to be back two days ago. Went to the Totentons to shoot some stuff, story on Maelstrom. Call back next week or just watch the news. Anything happens to her, I'll be the first to cover it. Where are you going? I think we better head to the Totentons. Totentons. What's that? They look like the dead. That's not the dead trousers, is it? Because that's the Totenhosen. It's the dead something or others. Hey, his um his security guards are back, but they're now friendly. Hello, Mr. Security Guy. Look at him. He's awesome. Right, let's get out of uh We'll go on our bike. Or we could just take the bus, not start. Let's be real rock stars and take the bus. There you go. We'll uh, catch the bus to the nightclub. And there we go. Let's go to the club and not get run over by that big truck. Who are those? Are they polis? No, they're gangsters. Let's uh, kill these gangsters.
Uh, maybe our gun physics will work at some point. I can hear, like, gunfire. So there's probably... Yeah, look, there's loads of gang stars. Let's just take this lot out and then we'll go in. his head off. Yeah, I need to drop off a bunch of uh, loot as well. So, I mean, that'll stand as like a bit of action for this episode. <laughs> yeah, I mean, the one thing about clearing out the gangsters as well is just ensuring that the map is loaded in correctly. As you saw, you know, we were shooting and shooting and nothing was hitting because none of the gangsters are loaded in. None of the enemies are loaded in. Okay, and then we're back at the club. It's also quite funny, once you clear out the gangsters, like normal people move back in and you sometimes see like a big crowd of guys there's another group. There you go. There's another lot down. It's, whoa! And it's a rave. So. Nah, we won't. We'll just use our pistol. Nuts to it. I do quite like these kind of raves. There are like gangsters at the rave. So you have to be a bit careful of their bystanders. And it looks like I did shoot a bystander on accident. Uh, yeah, this is the death and taxes. It's got quite a nice uh, sound. Quite a nice kind of gun sound. Don't rub me. But yeah, you do have to make sure you don't shoot any bystanders if you're like uh, clearing out a rave like that. Video games can sometimes be fun, like sometimes. Uh, but not that often. <laughs> I'm kidding. Ooh, there's something in the trunk. Set of combat boots. I think we are getting getting sidetracked now. Uh, the neat thing is you can just wander around Night City and if you know what to look for, like these kind of alleyways, then you're always guaranteed to find... Oops. Ah, <laughs> he killed himself. Oh, and there is the uh, Doomsday Whistle. So we could do the next part of the Kerry Eurodyne mission on the next episode. So, yeah, sorry, we got a little bit sidetracked with shooting up gangsters so yeah i'd like to say thanks for watching please do leave a like comment and subscribe and i'll see you on the next one uh where we'll carry on we'll go to the uh totem tants nightclub and 
uh, try and chat up Kerry Euro Tunnel. All right, bye for now. You can tell them in my name, you all go to hell.